What's going on, everyone? Hey, hey, I'm Mark Alvarez, and today, today I am back for part two of my Let's Play of Gran Turismo 1 for the PS1. Last Wednesday, you saw my the first part where I did the first four tracks. So today, I'm gonna do the bonus tracks. And so what I'm gonna do, like I did last a week ago today, a single race, easy difficulty. <coughs> well, which car do I want? I know, let's start with the Chevy. Corvette Grand Sport, let me see here. I'll pick the Corvette, and it's actually a C4 Corvette. I want to make it blue. I know track I'm going to. Autumn Ring. Oh, here we go. As you saw last night, I, fin I finished up my Test Drive 5 Let's Play. And so today I'm finishing up my Grand Turismo Let's Play. So yeah, so this is part two. And this, the, this is the final part. So, oh here we go. There's the Fair Lady. That was one of the, but <coughs> the MR2 GTS and Toyotas here. Oh my god, there's a big deep ass corner. The NSX is there. Do you see, you see that part that's blacked off? That's the that's that's um the, um that's the that's where um the the the, the miniature the lip the, the alternate version of this track is Auto Ring Mini. Yeah, because there's a there's a there's an alternate version of this track. This is and it's it's a really small version. It's the same track except it uses the only little portion of the track. It's called Autumn Ring Mini, and that part, see, that's where Autumn Ring Mini is, the parts where it blacked off. Autumn, but it only appears in simulation mode. Like I said in part one last Wednesday, the jumps at uh, some certain tracks are only available in arcade mode, not simulation mode. Yeah. The miniature version of this track is called Autumn Ring Mini. That's the alternate version of this track, and it's only available in simulation mode. It's not available in arcade mode like it is right here. <coughs> here we go. It's already the final lap. Of course, I'm driving a Chevy. You know, in NASCAR, Chevys always win. Uh, ever since 2003, they've won the manufacturer. Oh my God! The MR2 GTS had a dive bomb, and that unfortunately that didn't work out for him. But he he ended up losing positions, ended up ended up back to third. Like I was saying, Chevy's won the NASCAR manufacturer championship since two, every year since 2003. The last time they didn't win it was 2002, and Ford won it. Oh, I added it to my arm. Look at this, the NSX and I are side by side. It's going to be a good finish. I had to let him. I had to let him go right there, so I wouldn't um overshoot the corner and take him out. This guy is so damn strong. Remember, if you saw part one last week on why I did Trail Mountain, he was strong. And that's when I, um, uh, overshot the, um, uh, messed up the corner, spun myself out, and lost the race. And that's when it's on in third. And you saw that it was a trail mountain. I'm pulling away, but it's not over yet. I think it's still boost on me. We're almost there. Do not fail me now. Oh, we got this. I'm, pull I'm pulling away. I'm pulling away. Of course, Chevy wins. Chevy wins again, baby. You see, I'm mo I'm mostly a Dodge person with the Viper, but Chevy's my second favorite car mate because my favorite drivers Austin NASCAR drivers Austin and Ty Dillon, uh, and drive Chevy. Corvette's rule. All right. That was a really interesting race, and so that it looked like it was going to be a good finish until um. Until the very, until the last lap, the NSX just gave up. Here we go, next race. So what car do I want now? Just for the hell of it, I'm gonna drive a Subaru. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make it white. White Subaru and Preza or WRX. My friend Joey P from school, Joey Pizzano, has a Subaru and he's a massive Subaru fan. 
Let's see what card do I want? Now, if you saw last week, um, uh, that this card was a, to a, a victim of my, of my, of my, of my, of my stupidity, unintended stupidity. I was trying to push him out of the way, but the wind ended up putting, ended up putting him in the fence. Ended up racking him in the Mazda RX-7. And I was at Club in Stage Route 5. Alright, next race I'm going to do is Gate Forest Racing Way. Here we go. Yeah, I was just, I was just on my uh, part one last week. I do not like winning on that way. Hopefully, I, it, it, that's not the case to, today. Here we go. Oh damn the court that the Corvette Stingray's there. This car you know, if you play this current simulation mode, it'll suck, but, but I think in arcade mode it'll do good. So I'm gonna start in simulation mode if you gotta put it up against faster cars. Try this car is so damn loose. I think it'll like, jump somewhere. I gotta find it. Oh my god, this car is wiggly. It's wiggly wobbly. This, this damn car is wobbly. So I gotta be careful so I don't spin it out and lose control. <coughs> oh, the stingray's coming. I gotta block him. I gotta block. Oh, I put him in the wall. I put him in the wall. Nice block. Yeah, I did that. I did that earlier uh, last month when the winter started. I did that on NASCAR Rumble. I was playing as Dale Jarrett. Yeah, that's all I play. You'll see later this winter. I was playing as Dale Jarrett, and now uh, Jeremy Mayfield's getting ready to pass me. I think this was at um at the Metropolis uh, uh, um circuit. Oh my God, who was that? No. Anyway, I'll play in the Metropolis circuit. I think I was playing at Night Flight where you try to break the glass. I think it's Night Flight. Anyway, um, <coughs> Mayfield went to pass me, and I went to block him, and I ended up in, put him in the wall. I just did the same thing that Stingray just a while, just a just a minute a while, just a minute ago, just minutes ago. Yeah, I, mean, I guess I'm well known for that in my racing game. Like I tend to block people when they're trying to pass me, and instead instead of doing it making their clean block, I put them in the fence. I'm pulling away, so as long as I, as long as they don't mess it up, I got this. Yeah. We're almost there. Do not fail me now. Oh no, block. Oh, son of a bitch. You gotta be kidding me. Did you see that? Well, oh my god, a last lap. I guess that was a victim of a last lap pass. Damn! I had that was my race. I was I was miles ahead of the NSX. I was miles ahead of um. That was my race, but oh well, shit happens. Oh my god, that was very very close. How, I, where did he get the run? Where did that NSX get the run? Wow. Oh well. On to the next race. Let's see which car do I want. You know which car I'm going to pick? I'm going to pick a Nissan this time. I know which car I want. This purple Skyline G R GTR V Star, which is an R33. <coughs> Excuse me. It's gonna be purple. Wow, that was a close ass finish. I almost won that race, but that NSX got a big run. Oh well, I guess. Anyway, let's penultimate track, special stage group five. Here we go. Oh my god. I'm still can't. I'm probably never gonna. I'm probably still. I'm not. I'm probably gonna be talking about that that race that Deep Forest Racing Way for a while. My God. All right. Anyway, let's just move on, folks. On this race, here we go.
This is like Clubman stage with five but it's a lot longer. Oh, I love this song. As heaven is wide by garbage. Yeah, this is I use this as a birthday song for my one of, for one of my you now well, for one of my you for one of my one for my favorite you now are Emily Heller. She she's a she's a she um in case, in case you're wondering who that is she's a 16 year old you, you now are who I first discovered uh, back in the all uh, last summer. I I'm a you now are too but I don't really use it that much. I mean uh, her birthday was August 26. See what? Okay, anyway, see where that left side is. Was blocked. That's where Clubman Stage Route Five is. Anyway, I found her. I I found her on you now. And when she fan called me one time because I asked her to. We talked on the phone for so long. She was you and I still had me on Facebook and and so I um the day after her birthday, which I did because she never had me on Facebook until the day after her birthday. I made her belated birthday song to this song. It's playing in the background. As having is wide by garbage. She's a very sweet girl, so I'll post her. I'll post the links to her t Facebook and Twitter and Twitter, and in, in the in the description below. You know, you might you're not going to be disappointed. Wait, right. oh my God! Just imagine if this was the finish. Just imagine if this was the finish. I would have lost it just barely. I would have just barely lost it right there. Anyway, this is about the final lap already. This is a really badass car too. Nissan Skyline. I'm not gonna lose that race to this. I'm not gonna lose the race to the same damn car again. Right there to the left, where it's blacked off. Like I, I know I said it before. I just wanted to give it, just give a, give, give just a, a second reminder. Oh my God. That, right, right there to the left where you saw was blacked off. That's our clubman stage for five. Oh, three wide. It's not gonna work. I'm not gonna lose to you again. I'm gonna die bomb it. Hold on. Oh, this guy's gonna make it three wide. Oh my! Oh! Get out of my way. It's not over. It's not over. Can I get there? Can I get there? No, it looks like I'm gonna make it. It doesn't look like I'm gonna make it. The NSX beat me again! Like, come on! That was that was even that was even more exciting finish than a deep than a deep forest. Wow. That was an exciting finish right there. Better than I finished ahead at this track's counterpart last week, Columbus to Drew 5. Who is that guy that tried to dive bomb it? Oh my god, the, the Toyota Celica tried to dive bomb it. That's what lost me the race. I would have had that in a sex if, um, the, the Celica, so, I how you pronounce it, if the green Toyota didn't dive bomb the last corner. Didn't dive bomb the asses. If that green sweater didn't dive bomb the S's, I would have had the NSX and won the race. Oh well. Last week's going to be at Grand Valley Speedway. This is my number one favorite track in this whole game. I would have had that race won if the Toyota didn't die. If Celica didn't bot. I think I'm pronouncing it right. If I'm not pronouncing it correctly, I'm sorry. That Celica dive bomb the S's, that's what lost me the race. Well, let's go watch the last car. Oh, I know. Wait, no, no. Let's see. I'm trying to p figure it out. No, it all basically says I'm Mitsubishi. I'm racing the GTO Twin Turbo. You know, I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna make it this color. Last race is gonna be at Grand Valley Speedway. It's like this track, except that it's longer. It uses the west section, the part that's blocked off, as you see there. So, I mean, on this version, the east section will be blacked off. Alright, here we go.
So this is the last race, so I'll just let's I'll just let's play. I'll just let's play. Hopefully I can I can win. Hopefully I can win. Here we go. Hopefully I can close this out with the bang with the win. Green flag is out, we are underway. This is the car I was racing with just a while ago. Three wide in the first turn. See that the part part was black though, right there's where Grand Valley East is. The east section. There's the same tracks I've used in short and use the east section instead of this section, which is west. Oh my god, I got an itch on my back. And I'm about to wreck. I'm in the grass. I just lost four positions because of that. <coughs> three wide, three wide. I'm gonna go in the middle. I'm going in the fucking middle. There's no way they're gonna keep me from going in the middle. Look at this. <laughs> pass those, pass that shit. Right, and there's another part where Grand Valley East is blocked off. I like this version better than I do the e the, the East the other version. I like this the regular version of this track better than the Eastern version. <laughs> this, this bridge is somewhere is so beautiful. To be honest with you. Oh, save it. Hang on to it. I'm not losing. I'm not losing to this asshole again. Look at that, he's trying, he's doing everything he can to beat me. He's bu he's bumping and rubbing all over me, oh my god. I'm blocking him, I'm blocking Oh, he did the crossover, he did the crossover. Here we go, white flag, final lap. Can I, be can I beat this asshole this time? I hope I can. Now the Mazda is going in, going for the lead on me. The RX-7. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. This, yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, as you can see, that said, um, this week has more has been more more has had better finishes. Uh, be, this week, the races I've done on this on this on this. Oh my God! I can't talk. The the races I've done this week are have a lot more a lot more exciting finishes than last week. To be honest with you, as you see, you, you, as you saw the finish at Deep Forest and, and Special Stage Route Five. The, they, those are great. Those were good finishes. Those are actually those more than good finishes. They were great finishes. Hopefully, we can, if it, there's a great finish right now, I hope I can I can be the one that come on that comes out on top. Okay, we're almost there. Do not fail me now. Do not let that asshole in the NSX catch up to me. It's not screwed up. Should break right here. Good job. There you go. Looks like I got this. As long as they don't boost on me like like they did at Deep Forest. Yes, I win. I win. Hell yeah, baby. All in a line together again. Yeah, like I said in part one last week, I used to say that all the time. I used to say that all the time at this track and Grand, and Grand Valley East. If they're on the straight line at the top or bottom. Le uh, that was a kind of a boring finish, but as long as I won, that's all that matters. Man. So, yeah. That... That was... At least I... I how many... I think... If I would have... Um, I think I won two races. Um, some... Autumn Ring. Let me see here. I won Autumn Ring and Grand Valley Speedway, and I finished, um, I finished second at Deep Forest and Special Stage Route 5. I guess I didn't do too bad, and at least it's better than coming in last. Well, that does it for this Let's Play of Grand Turismo. I hope you all enjoyed it as much as I did. 
maybe in the future I'll, I'll play this with a friend. Who knows? I play. I'm. I. I play. I'm gonna. Uh, my. My channel's gonna contain me playing with many different people. Like uh, uh, mostly my friends. So yeah. Hope. Uh, hope y'all enjoy this let's play. I don't know what my next let's play will be, but uh, but yeah, um, I'll let you guys know as soon in my fan group on Facebook as soon as possible. This is Mark Oliver saying, have a good evening, everyone. Take care.